I bring greetings to all the viewers in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Well, today I would like to tell you the things that the Lord delights in. What is that the Lord loves? Well, I would like to share from Jeremiah chapter 9, verse 23 and 24. It says, Thus said the Lord, Let not the wise man glory in his wisdom, neither let the mighty man glory in his might, let not the rich man glory in his riches, but let him that glorieth glory in this, that he understandeth and knoweth me, that I am the Lord which exercise loving kindness, judgment and righteousness in the earth. For in these things I delight, said the Lord. While many of us, we see God who is always with a stick ready to beat us up whenever we mess up or whenever we make a mistake, He wants to punish us and He wants to chastise us. We see God with that perspective. But here, God is telling, I would love when people know me and understand me that I am the God who exerciseth loving kindness see that loving kindness he has a kind of kindness with love you know if you are broke if you are sick if you are poor he want to heal you bless you lift you up if you mess up he want to clean you and again teach you and make you strong so that this time you will stand strong that means every time you mess up or you fall, he wants you to come to him rather than going away from him, thinking that he is a God who will beat us up every time we mess up. We see God in this way, but whenever we see God in a way that he is a loving God who wants to love us, no matter what we go through and what we are in, it doesn't mean that he's not a God of righteousness. He's also a God of righteousness and holiness, but he deals in a way of love and kindness which will help us to grow in him and then be righteous and holy so you need to first understand that he, he is a God who wants to exercise first loving kindness he wants to love us he is a, he's a very kind hearted tender hearted God you know he is sense to to our feelings he is a good God so as you all agree with me that this God is a God who is a loving, kind-hearted God, the Lord is rejoicing in you and me as we hear and listen to this sermon. So today I want you to pray more, believe more and stand fast in your faith no matter what you are going through because He is a loving God and God delights in this. I want all of you to hold this all your life that he is a loving, kind-hearted God so that nothing will put you away from this God. Nothing can separate you from the love of this God. I bless you all in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.